If you typically work with Google software or Google Drive and you want to be able to use that with ArcGIS software, there's a couple things we need to do. The important thing to remember at the start of this process is that this only works with vector data. This does not work with raster data and that is because in the path name for Google folders there is a space between the words and this will cause the raster tools to fail most often. There's always a possibility it might work but it usually does not. So if you need to work with a lot of raster data I would recommend to use a Windows network drive instead or a GIS server whatever you have but this process will probably not work with raster data. It does work very well with vector data. So if we want to connect this to ArcGIS Pro, the first thing we need to do is make sure we have Google Drive for desktop installed. The quickest way to do this is to just go to your Google Drive. And on the top right right here, there's a little configuration wheel and you can do get drive for desktop. You can also Google just Google Drive for desktop and it will give you the link to download the app. This actually works with both Mac and Windows. ArcGIS is not compatible with Mac, but you can download the Google Drive for desktop on Mac as well. Once you have it installed, you'll notice that this Google Drive G folder will appear on your computer. And if you click on that, it'll give you a direct look into your drive and all of your shared drives. So you can actually put data in a shared drive and this will also work. Or you can do it in just your drive. Uh, create as many folders as you like. It works pretty well. Once we're in ArcGIS Pro, if you want to connect your drive folder, just right click on folders and hit add folder connection and then go to your G drive and you'll notice both of your drives will show up in here I'm going to go to my drive and then just connect to this folder that I want to work with if you expand it now you'll notice that all of your fol folders will appear it also works to store a geo database into a Google Drive folder. It will register that. You can see all of the data for the most part, work with it just like you would a GIS server. Again, this does not work with raster data, but it does work very well with vector data and all of the tools associated with vector data.